Uh, Alex Michaelis, Michaelis Boyd Architects. This is my 2020 vision. Tim Boyd, Michaelis Boyd Architects. This is my 2020 vision. Um, we're, we're architects and we uh, spend quite a lot of time looking at materials and energy systems for both uh, residential houses and uh, restaurants, clubs, hotels, everything we do. Um, and it's quite interesting. You know, we, we're, we're beginning to put systems in and you know, have materials in houses that make them pretty much uh, carbon neutral. Restaurants have a huge amount of waste um, and you know, we're beginning to recycle that waste in, in energy terms and heat terms and reuse that, which is quite interesting. And everyone's quite excited by that. So, you know, even some of the chain restaurants are, are doing that. Um, and it's, it's not difficult and we're not asking people to change the way they live. Uh, in fact, they're quite surprised that there's nearly no change in the way they live, but uh, in the background these other systems are going on. Well, the, the, I mean, the other thing that we are very keen on doing is actually making sure that we're, we're still creating aesthetically beautiful spaces, so both in housing and in public spaces. The interesting thing in any sort of architectural movement is that um, you know, along with new technology and new materials, uh, a new style and a new language of arch architecture appears. And we believe that we're at this sort of very exciting moment in, in architecture where, along with the, the technology, we're actually going to be able to create extremely interesting, extremely beautiful buildings. What, apart from architecture, we're also working on energy systems, and this is Energy Island, um, which is uh, a system to make uh, energy and desalinated water and uh, a lot of desalinated water it basically uses the world's biggest uh, soda collector the sea in the, in the central areas uh, to do this which recharges every day it's beginning to get some momentum and water is going to be the biggest problem there is in the world uh, so quite interesting and Obama's back to Lockheed are working on it and I think when the first one's done uh, people will say why didn't we do this before so we need to all use less energy and less resources, but there are systems out there that are uh, much more, uh, less harmful to the planet than nuclear and other that, that, that will start becoming available, which is very exciting.